Welcome back to the channel. In this episode, we are heading up to the north to visit Akureyri, the second largest city in Iceland. Akureyri is commonly referred to as the capital of the north and provides a large array of tourist attractions ranging from whale watching to hiking and day trips to the beautiful Lake Mývatn area. While winter had all but faded away here in the south, the northern part of the country was still in the grips of a cold and snowy winter, which was something that we noticed as the countryside changed progressively from brown grass to white snow the further north we got. The Akureyri Botanical Gardens are one of the northernmost botanical gardens in the world and there are approximately 430 native Icelandic species of plants to check out as well as over 7,000 examples of foreign species that have managed to grow here. There wasn't much to see today unfortunately due to all the snow so we'll be checking this out again in the summertime. Oh, right. <gasps> look at, which one, what, what did you get? Uh, uh, it's a, a milk ice cream, vanilla, with a white chocolate. Wow. <laughs> We decided to go out for a nice little cross-country ski in a beautiful forest just on the edge of the city here in Akureyri. So luckily over the last couple of days we've had some uh, good snowfall. As you can probably see around us here, it's actually winter here in the north of Iceland. Uh, so I think we've got to go take a nice little ski and we'll show you what we can find. Skidafjall has been one of the prime skiing areas of Iceland for nearly 40 years. The ski resort is situated just 5 kilometers outside the city and offers great views over Eyjafjörður. But we decided to stop first by Godafoss. It means the God's waterfalls. So let's check that out.
Mivatan literally means the lake of midges, and it's the first animal you will notice if traveling in the summertime. It is also the fourth largest lake in the country. Mivatan is located in an incredibly active geothermal area, which gives you the opportunity to bathe in naturally heated waters. This is probably best done at Mivatan Nature Baths, uh, which is also called the Blue Lagoon of the North. A link will be provided in the description. Mivatan has some of the best bird watching available in Iceland. It has more species of duck than anywhere else in the world. And as the lake is quite shallow, it is a rich source of nutrition and energy for the animals. Mivatan was also one of the filming locations for Game of Thrones, and it was used to film the lands north of the wall, such as Mance Raider's Wildling Camp. Okay, so we're just finishing up now a nice little trek around Lake Mivatan here, which is uh, roughly an hour's drive away from Akureyri if you're heading uh, eastbound, I do believe. Uh, very, very flat, very, very easy. I think it's a perfect track for beginners and uh, yeah, I can highly recommend it, especially on a day like this when we have some beautiful snow. Uh, a little bit overcast, but it's still nice and sunny out, I think. So how do you feel? It was your uh, third, fourth time on skis? Uh, yeah, pretty good, I reckon. I think uh, it's always worth having a little bit of practice and this area is probably the best place to do the practice. Nice and flat, hardly any downhills anywhere and you can get, uh, yeah, get your ski on. Perfect. That's all for today guys. Uh, this video turned out to be a little bit longer than we initially planned so we're going to split it into two parts and in the next episode you're going to see what else we got up to there up in the north. So we'll leave you now with some beautiful drone footage and we'll see you then. Bye for now.